Hey, hello everyone. Can you guys all hear me okay? I have a, a different mic that I'm trying out tonight. So, hi Roro, let's go back up here. Let me see who all's here. Hello, he says, how are you doing tonight? And Jacob, I don't know if he got back from dinner yet or not. Hello, Jennifer, hello, Nada. Hello, uh, so I'm going down those. Hi, Janice, so you made it, huh? Come on down. For some reason, my heyday was completely changed. Just hold off on your uh, questions on this and we'll discuss them one at a time here. Uh, those affected, okay. Hey, Russell, how are you? Coming on down the list here, seeing who I'm missing. Hey, D, or hi, is it Hey, Dia? Hey, Dia, how are you? Uh, hello, C. Hello, Peter. Uh, Ian, hello. Katie Mady, hello, how are you? Hello, Debbie. Hello, Carol. You guys keep talking. I won't get through the list here. <laughs> uh, hello, Carolyn. If I've missed somebody, I'm sorry, but hello. Hello, Kate. Kate Meeks, that is. I think we've had a couple of cases. Hello, Rockstar. How are you? Hello, Q. Hello, Lynn. I think I've just about hit everybody. If I didn't, just say hello to me again and we'll start all over. <laughs> okay. Uh, let me scroll back up here again. I see you guys are already making some comments about what happened today. And I think I have a few answers or I can tell you what all is affected. Um, Janice says, for some reason, her heyday house was completely changed. Oh, you were able to change it back? Well, that's good. We were going to test that in stream tonight. Uh, I, I think most of the people that were affected with the problem were all those that were on their farms before they took it into before they took the game into maintenance. After the, our, the issues were happening, so they took it into maintenance. But those that were on the farm at that time were the ones who were mostly affected. Those who came after maintenance did not seem to have any of these problems. Okay, but we're going to talk about why some of the problems happened. Uh, keep going. They did add the spot for the birthday designs in the Maggie book, okay. Has anyone had uh, any problems with redressing their buildings and everything with the Maggie designs? Let's go down here to Maggie's book. Let's start with her. Hello, Maggie. Uh, I was told by someone that their uh, Maggie book was totally reset. Okay, just, gosh, you guys are just saying so much here. Uh, let's see. They tell me that their 75% uh, discount was going off of their uh, book. Usually it's marked when you can reinstall something, but he, uh, he said his was all gone, so that's the reason. Does anybody else see any change in their uh, Maggie book right now? <clears throat> Hello, Tracy. Hello, Tanya. Hello, MJ. Okay, everyone keeps wanting to talk about the windmills. So let me see if I can explain to you exactly what happened. Like I said, everyone who was on before maintenance are the ones that seem to be having the problem. When, uh, first of all, 
I believe it all started after when the Blossom Derby was scheduled to run. So it's just possible that there's some codes in the Blossom Derby that interfered with these other things that we don't know yet. They haven't told us yet. But when the people who were finishing up their valley, collecting their valley prizes, that all went bonkers on them. They couldn't get into the valley. They couldn't do anything with their farm pass. So during the fix, um, Heyday set it up where people who had problems with the farm pass got um, rewarded 600 points and their pass was supposed to be restored so they could finish it out or whatever. But that didn't happen. Instead of just getting the 600 points, they got the little chicken feet that told them they had another valley. So a lot of people went in and did that second valley. The problem with doing that second valley was when it closed, it read the 600 points for 600 windmills. So that's the crossover between those two uh, instructions um, is what happened. That's why that's, I imagine everyone that did the second valley are the ones with the 600 windmills. And you got the 600 points before you started that second valley. So I don't know if they're going to be taking the windmills back from you or not. If they're, I can't see why they would let you keep them all. I mean, 600 wood windmills, my gosh. Does anybody have any questions about this now? I was playing, it was 4.30 a.m. Uh, Janice, what time, where are you located? Where's your time zone? Hello, Duke. Hello, Laura. Laura Morgan. <laughs> you lost your valley points? Yeah, people lost their, their tokens and um, they couldn't collect from the valley. I don't know what happened with those that after the maintenance was over. I haven't heard anyone say that they were able to finish out the valley or anything. But after maintenance, I was able to because I wasn't online at the time that the system went down. Uh, is it just here the stream ended? No, I haven't been moving my farm, if that's what you mean. I guess I should wiggle it around a little bit for you guys. Yes, they were having problems. Let's talk about the bananas. This, this problem existed yesterday, okay? I came over to collect some bananas yesterday, and look, I'm going to show you now. Can't collect those bananas, see that? I cannot collect those bananas, but here's a, uh, I think this is a mature tree, we'll find out. Let's see how many it'll let me collect. Okay, that was a that was not a mature tree. I need a tree that's got it's in its fourth stage. That one is that one. I'll be collecting a bunch of bananas here. Okay, there's one. See it only collected one banana. So in the first and second stages, you'll be able to collect all the bananas. But when it comes to the third stage of that tree, you will only be able to collect one of them. And I will show that to you now. I'm going to spend some diamonds here to show you guys what's going on. Okay, brand new tree. Those trees are for the monkeys. <laughs> now, uh, you can't do anything with them right now. I made a video of it, uh, and they are taking it to the, uh, the team your tech team and try to figure out what's going on. But here's a brand new tree. I'm going to force it to the first stage and I'm gonna collect my bananas the first stage. Okay, I'm gonna force it to the second stage. Okay, now I get my three bananas. Now I'm going to force it to the third stage. I got one banana. So if you are running short on bananas until this is fixed, Go ahead and buy the banana tree, but only take them through the first and second stage. 
I don't know what we're going to have to do with these. You can't cut them down or anything. You can't ask for any help. And I guess I can just sit here and look at them like this for the rest of my hay days. <laughs> so that's the banana glitch. They know about it. They knew about it yesterday. So something is crossed up in the coating that's not bringing the farm to us in the correct manner. Uh, anything else we got to cover? We covered the uh, farm pass glitch, the banana glitch. We talked about the Maggie having the problems. And on, I didn't look to see if uh, mine didn't reset, like I said, because I wasn't on the game before maintenance. And I came after. So mine didn't reset. But just for kicks, let's go over here and look at somebody's farm. Almost couldn't find him. You might recognize who this is. He, he got 600 of the windmills. And he put them to use down here on his farm. You know, you can get a little dizzy watching those windmills there. But this is Rockstar. And I told him he had to change his name to Windy Rock because of all the windmills. But he was, he got these too. So the sanctuary book, this sanctuary book isn't really that big of a deal. Uh, it's just out of order. Let's see what they did with it. Let me go see so I can show you. Okay. The order of the sanctuary book should be after the gorillas, or the reindeer it is, it should be the fox goes. We've got the fox before the uh, cheetahs, okay? Mm -hmm. And what mm -hmm. should follow after the adult animals, animals is the baby animals, and they're not following. As you can see, they're totally out of order. So I, they did not fix that. Hello, Retta, how are you? And uh, Retta, you're, are you having any kind of issues? due to all that makes this morning. Okay, somebody said too that the lobster pots were not working correctly. Let's go take a look. I think I have some lobster. It's not receiving the lobster. It's going into the pot, no problem there. But then I wasn't on my farm before the maintenance, so. I'm probably not going to have the issues that a lot of you are having. It's working on that for me. We got some fishing nets that we can, or do we? This has 30 minutes to go. You guys remind me, we'll go and see what kind of goodies I can get. Russell, you're buffering. Okay, no issues over here as far as I can see. Uh, if there's an issue with loading up the nets or something. No, that went in okay. So this is all okay. Who else is, who else buffering? You can't, that's right. Uh, Rockstar showed me that when he tries to go into edit mode, let's see if it happens to me here, Rockstar. As soon as he hits the edit button, it logs him out of his farm. <laughs> Excuse me. Sorry about that. You guys just choke me up. <laughs> but, uh, Okay, we checked the lobster pots, and we don't have an issue with that. Does anyone else have an issue with it? Have you tried to see if your pots are receiving the lobster, or if you can even run the lobster traps? The farm I have on my... When I connect to the diamond shop, they cannot purchase anything. Okay, um, 
they, there is a lot of issues I know that's going on with the uh, fire tablets. I don't know if maybe you should remove the game and reinstall it. Mine works. I just went into it. I, I'm assuming it's going to work okay. Let's see if I got a farm down here I can play with or something. <gasps> a rock star. Did you see that? It went through to the mode, okay. So let's go back out. We're going to save this one. It didn't kick me out at all. You want XP again? <laughs> Retta, did you do the farm pass again? Did you do it a second time? I know you're up and playing when it broke. Did you get 600 windmills? Let's go find out. Let's go rat on him. Let's go rat on Retta. Oh, I don't see any windmills out here. I don't see any windmills here. <laughs> Reddit, did you get 600 windmills and not put them to work yet? Yeah, Rockstar tried all his other farms and it's only on one farm. He sh uh, showed me that in a video. Your mom's having problems with her Amazon tablet. You got the windmill the legit way. <laughs> oh, I'm sure those people got it the legit, got one the legit way too. I don't know. I hate to think that 600 windmills is their compensation for the system breaking. <laughs> no, tell them to get me farm pass three times. <laughs> sure, Reda. <laughs> you won one in the stream. You gave it away. Okay, we're in the, uh, is there anything else about the update, about the changes or anything? Before we go, I'm going to be doing some tasks for the um, Blossom Derby here. I saw your recent post a little more, oh. oh. I'm so sorry about that, Suzanne. Yeah, you know, just yesterday, I could have swore Phoebe was brushing against my leg and then she laid on my foot like she always did so my house is haunted by a dog <laughs> just love that dog so much uh we were going to go somewhere here yeah here we go who got the two cons and the peacocks let's see a show of hands for the for the peacocks <laughs> Okay, this is the farm when there was the um, glitch on the Willow Fortune. Yep, our, our fire babies are just like our children in a way because unconditional love. Okay, back to when they had, they first started with the peacocks, there was a glitch on the um, wheel where they put one of the chick vouchers. Uh, Miss Kate, Meeks here, buzz me, and she says, hey, look what I got. <laughs> and so she told me she got on the wheel, so I went flying to my wheel. Well, this is the only farm that had the peacock, the peacock ticket, or the peacock chick ticket on it. So I immediately started spending, and spending the diamonds to get the wheel, and I ended up getting enough for the, to get both of the peacocks. And you can see one of them laying over here. This is William, and he's sleeping, and I don't know where the brown one goes off to, who is name is Kate, because William and Kate, you know. Uh, I'm looking for Kate now. Does anybody see her? She hides. I'm telling you, I don't know where that woman goes to. <laughs> All right, but I got the peacocks, and we don't even see them sleeping here. Well, let's feed them and call them home. As you can see, they have the same food as the, uh, the two cons has the same as our peacocks. So here they come.
It comes one of the peacocks. And you know what? We can name them. William and Kate are the two uh, peacocks. What can we name the toucans? Let's start out with the first, the Kill Bill Toucan. The Ed Brown goes and hides. Maybe she's avoiding the housework or something, who knows? I remember as a kid growing up on the farm when it was time to do housework, my brothers would all disappear and not be found, and so they didn't do their share. Okay, we need names for the Kill Bill Toucan. I'm not going to do it the way Ricky did. Check Tom. Yeah, Tom's standing here waiting to go. Uh, Tom's been getting the new products for me. Name the Toucan Sam. That's a lot of people said Megan and Harry. Uh, no, Josh, I'm sorry. They're not my favorite people. <laughs> I should have said I won't name them Megan and Harry. <laughs> uh, what's the William and Kate's children's name? Does anybody know off the top of their head? Your white peacock. Well, I opted, instead of getting the white peacock, I opted to get uh, both of the two kinds here. Fruit Loop. These peaches, these are all from Ricky's stream, all these suggestions. Come on. George, Charlotte, and Lewis. George is the... Charlotte was the first one, wasn't she? I should say the names for the next peacock I get. I think Charlotte was the first, I, wasn't she? Which is a food I don't like. Mm, quite a bit. <laughs> George is the oldest. Ah, Tracy would know. <laughs> she is from the UK. Well, since they're not peacocks, let's not name them after the royal family. Hello, Jennifer Kay. How are you? Tommy? Tommy. Uh, that, kind of, that sounds nice, Tommy. I don't think I've named all of my animals on this farm anyway. Kate says Sam. What toffee or which candy? Okay, got to name the, this. Polly. Polly wants a cracker? Polly is good. Polly and Tommy. Those are two good choices. Well, I have two to name, don't I? Okay. Hello, Darlene. Welcome. Bill. Tommy was the first suggestion that came up, so we're going to name him Tommy. Okay, we got Tommy there. Now we have another one up here, and what was the other name that I saw? Polly. Okay, we're going to name this one Polly. And they are named. <clears throat> Name it Bill since this kind of sounds like Kill Bill in the movie Kill Bill. Oh, I didn't know there was a movie. I'm not a big movie buff. <laughs> Tootie. That's a cute name. I don't think I've named all the animals over here. We'll save that for a later stream maybe. But this is where I have all of my birds except for the white peacock. And I'm going to be working on that. Let's see how much do I have to do. <laughs> uh, three months I'll have my white peacock. I called mine Tinny the Toucan. 
That's a cute name, too. Okay, let's go. Let's see, Tron, you didn't, or who asked the question? Josh? The toffee? Are the, the new candies or the toffee? Oh, this is empty. This should not work. Um, three butters. Two butters on the chili fudge. Two butters on the lemon fudge. Two. Okay, it's the rich fudge that asks for three butter. So I need to fill this machine up. And I got nine there. Nine. Fifteen. Fifteen. And nine. We'll do some mint. And I will do some of the fudge. I like fudge. That's what I thought you meant because I didn't think the toffee took three butter. Let's see, where is that machine? Here we go. Toffee takes one butter. So, okay, let's go back over to the main farm again. You're two million coins behind to catch up with the machines. Yeah, those machines really hurt later on. As you saw, the farm I was just on, I don't have the pottery on that one because I was holding off for something better than the pottery. What, do you, what did I have for dinner? You need ideas. <laughs> uh, I went I went out to uh, Taco Bell because my husband said he wanted tacos. Taco Bell happened to be about uh, eight or ten cars waiting in line and I was rushing it because it was just an hour before the stream so I called hubby and I said hey there's too many people here I won't make it in time and he said, well, go buy McDonald's. So I went by McDonald's and got fish sandwiches for us. So that's what we had for dinner. Real, real nutritious, right? Mm -hmm. uh, look, I still have these people coming. They're not doing this today, are they? Is, is that what the... Three weeks ago, this must be it. We, okay, we're in just three days ago. I'm sorry, I read that wrong. Monday. Okay, the visitors are supposed to have been here yesterday. And why are they here hey. today still asking for the yard stuff? Yeah, but why are the visitors still here? That's one little thing they didn't fix. So, nope, you can go and mm -hmm. you, mm, yeah, wouldn't make a lot on that, but you can have it. To send them on their way. When is the up, the next update? <laughs> uh, well, you know what I can say. We all know that we always have an update around the birthday each year of heyday. So the birthday is coming up in June. So I think we can anticipate something then. I I won't say soonish, which I just said, but. Um, that gives you, you know, an idea because they, they kind of follow their plan. Hello, Charlie. So, yeah, the, ne the next update will probably be uh, like they've always done in the past, hopefully around birthday time, which is June 22nd, Futurist. <laughs> I have some of those in the machine too. They take one hour and 42 minutes. I always send time after stuff takes a long time except with the new products. He was helping me get a head start on those. I can do two. Let's see if we have any bread in the making, so we do. I'm okay trying to decide my time for Thursday. I'm 
under and out of space here in my barn. Okay, I don't need to collect any more to run the trucks. I'm going to go over here and see if I can do the trucks. Nope, someone else is doing it. So now I will have to take the mining task. I have three tasks to go yet tonight. Thanks to the uh, maintenance today, we got a little behind. This is the fastest task they have. I, I don't think I need all this ore. It's just going to fill up my barn. Am I tapping too loud? <laughs> now I just have to go one at a time. Okay, done with that one. Let's see if anyone else is finished so that I can do the next step. Right now we're leading, so we're not pushing really hard. Wow, look at that horse go. <laughs> We're like 10,000 points ahead of our nearest contender. You know what is so interesting about the mine is, let's, let's see if I can get them to do this. I'm going to move the stable up here. Call the horses into it. And I'll blow something up in the mine. <laughs> here they come, very slowly, but they'll be here. There they go, all running in a herd. Or do you call a group of horses a herd? <laughs> it's so boomy. Okay, we're going to blow up the mine here. Now here's the horses. Now, before I used to have them near the mine, and they would not be too happy about it, or they go and stare at it. Watch. I didn't hear anything. They're not doing much like they, like I've seen them do before. Uh, Darlene, your friend should have gotten uh, the... Um, Mm. She should have gotten something delivered by Alfred for the farm pass. And she was on during the, or just before the maintenance. Have her remove everything that's in the background on her device and uh, turn off the device log back into the farm and see if it improves it or anything. Because sometimes the, something running in the background can interfere. Somebody loves having their house super cold. Oh, Suzanne. <laughs> My husband would freeze me out. The chicken will get scared. The chick, yeah, uh, let's put a let's move these out of the way. Uh, where are the chickies? Over here. Now, Rose is slacking again. All the other animals get scared too, Retta. Why won't it give me my feed? I just found a glitch, didn't I? It won't let me feed them. No, Rose popped in there and fed them before I could. Okay, thank you, Rose. Let's see what happens. Nobody's doing anything. They're making me look silly. <laughs> they didn't do anything, Retta. I know they will on another farm. Uh, which ones are the closest to them? Let me check a farm and I'll see. I love to watch them get all shook up, though. 
I'm heartless. <laughs> uh, which farm are they closest to? Hmm. I'm not seeing a farm this closest. You're anything but heartless. Oh, I am. I love to see these animals squirm around when I blow up the mine. Well, they're not going to do anything. And I, I get tired of roads slacking on me. And this is why I usually build up such an abundance of milk and uh, other products. Is because I jump in there and close out your task. Ah, thanks. Yeah, thanks. It's okay. I'm still waiting for someone else to give me one. Let's see. Rock is doing the sugar cane, which I already have the sugar cane planted. And hemp is doing the... Somebody needs help. Hemp needed something. Sugar cane up. Well, I wasn't there to grab it. We always talk and communicate during a Blossom Derby. That's the only way you can get all your tasks done and done properly. Open communication. And even ask, if you're waiting for a task, ask, an ex ask a player when they'll be finished so that you'll be ready for to take that task. As you can see here, look at Rose. Rose is sitting. Where's she sitting at? I'm going to fire Rose. She's such a slacker. Let's see if she, oh, she didn't feed the piggies. Rose, Rose, Rose. No, if you can jump in here and feed them before she does, it seems to, for me, it seems that it increases the amount that I have in storage. Scare the donkeys. Oh, <laughs> Yeah, I got you, Kate. <laughs> You're not sure they understand how it works. Hey, me, it's usually in your derby. Rose, rose, rose. Hey, it's usually in the derby. Let's see. Uh... I think he has a truck task, but I'm asking now. And Rockstar, Al, uh, Rockstar, are you here? How much longer on the uh, sugar cane? This is your favorite derby. This you have to, like I said, you got to communicate. Um, we only got three tasks, but there's only six of us in the derby. And I always use this as my guide as to what tasks they need to do. Um, we've only had eight tasks, I believe, so far. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, we've only had eight tasks so far. So I have uh, one person that has finished all eight that we have so far. <laughs> and uh, Rock and Hemp are finishing their eighth one, so it'll be up to, oh, and Jessica's waiting for her eighth one, too. And Dee's got hers. Why? They're not showing them in the order they or normally do. And I still have to do two tasks. Then as soon as we get those tasks all done, I believe we can trash the mining task. Let's find out. Has everyone usually I keep a close watch on today. It was really a very messed up day. 
I couldn't say hi or chat because I was walking my dog. <laughs> you did the mining task already, Jessica? D failed a task? No. She just hasn't done one yet. Or done the task. Let's see. No? No, she, that's correct. She's done eight out of nine. And we always do the tenth task. It always goes in point order. Okay. I'm just so used to seeing everybody finishing their task pretty much on schedule. It's a point difference because of the type of derby. Uh, I gotta see what Ian said about it. D failed a task. No, she's okay. Hello, Mary Beth. But I, I, I don't think it, I just need two more tasks. I was thinking it didn't register my mining, but it did. Hi, Sherry, how are you? You know, we should go back to doing the mystery guest. Seeing Sherry reminded me of it, because in Russell, we've had a great time on those. Do I need pumpkins? Not usually, Rena. I only buy pumpkins as I need them. Uh, I don't grow them hard unless it's a task or... No, I don't need any pumpkins. Thank you very much. My fault, I don't understand the Blossom Derby. Well, each task Everyone should do each task in order to get the maximum points. They start at 320, next is 350, 375, and then the final tasks are all at 400 each. So as you can see, I showed you here that um, Rock, Wendy Rock, he is now, well, hello, good father. How are you? It's so great to see you here. Everyone, good father, is our, uh, is it Iraqi? Content creator. Great to see you here. Thanks for popping in. Did I see you about, okay. Thanks, Jessica. Okay, back to Ian. Uh, as you can see here, Rock and Hemp, they're both doing the task. And after they do the task, then I will do them and we'll be able to trash them. But you've got to keep tracks of everybody. If you only have three people doing a Blossom Derby, your points are only going to go to... Uh, 320, 350, and 375 because you can only do each task once. Everybody does the task. You know, it's hard to really explain it to you unless you just sit here in my derby, my hood, and watch us. <laughs> but we get it done. My barn is full, can't do anything. Today has been such a crazy, wacky day with the um, heyday being down for so long. Well, thank you, Mary Beth. I appreciate that. Okay, I've got that loaded. I tried to load it again. Let's see where the barn is now. I only have nine spaces. So what can we do to make some room here? I need all this. I need it for my candy. Russell, look what I'm selling. <laughs> and I believe I have more in the makings over here. Yes, I do. So I'm going to have to sell some of my wheat bundles here. 
look at that, Russell. <laughs> He's already s s sold me wheat bundles every time we're in stream. <gasps> yeah, I've got about 30 sitting over there now to be collected. <gasps> see, see my uh, sugar cane is all ready to go. Oh, see, that is a fantastic uh, explanation. You hand off the uh, task to the next runner, or <laughs> the next farmer. That's a great explanation. Fantastic. Russell, you bought some back. Russell, do you want more? Because, I, like I said, I have some sitting over here. And I probably have some in the machine. And after I finish, did you see that? Rose is waiting for me for chickens. Rose, you don't have to wait. <laughs> that is absolutely, see, that's the best explanation I've seen of the Blossom Derby yet. Perfect. Anybody done? Oh. Rockstar, how much longer on the sugar cane? He did the mining. So where are we here? I don't know. Then hemp has done the mining. And I did the mining. I'm going to take my chances and trash the mining task and see if we can get another good task up here. All right. So you have to have an empty spot to get your next task. So it's not necessary to trash all the other ones. We'll get we'll get a 320 task here, but it might not be one that we want to do, so then I'll keep trashing until I get one that we can do really fast. That is yeah, see, I'm really amazed that I'm gonna steal that. I am definitely gonna steal that. <laughs> Definitely. Hold on, everybody. I was also a key punch operator back in the day. Diane, really? Yeah. <laughs> Those were the fun days, wasn't it? Um, what Diane is talking about, I think I've explained this to you before, was that I've been working in computers since the key punch days. And um, we had to, the programmers, a big mainframe was the computer. And the programmers would actually write up what the computer was supposed to do. And we would enter this in on these cards. And then we would do the work also, whatever it involved. Uh, I worked for the railroad at that time, and uh, we had to know where all the rail cars were and the engines and all that stuff, so this is what this computer would do. We'd enter in where these uh, trains were all located, uh, punching them into the cards. Then they'd feed their program cards into one side and feed the work cards into another side, and that's how they'd get their reports printed out. So the field of technology has just gone so far, so fast, I feel like I'm still in the 70s. Three fourths better got this annoying. Oh, I'm sorry that you don't feel good, Kim. Get better. Do the derbies follow a schedule? If so, when should the next bingo derby be? Uh, they pretty much have a schedule. I think uh, <laughs> three or four days. Yep, there is a schedule. I have a calendar, but I can't tell you what it is beforehand. Um, at least, you know, they do give us that. <laughs> um, right. And sometimes they will change it up. Maybe certain things interfere with it that week, and they will change up the derby, which 
I think that the Blossom Derby should not have occurred with the update. I don't think it has in the past. I can go back and look at my uh, calendars from 2019 and 2020, but I don't think they ever did a Blossom Derby during an update. So maybe this is the thing that uh, took the uh, heyday down. I don't know. Because it's just really strange. You miss the mystery. The mystery is coming up soon. It really is. Just as long as it's not a, a bunny mystery. We do not want that because you could get a um, goat milk task, bacon task. Are those the three or the two? And strawberry task. Those three you don't want in a mystery derby. Yep, don't want that in a mystery derby. I don't want it in a power derby either. Charlie, I don't know that. Um, this, I've not done coding or anything, and um, not for iOS devices, but it's, um, I just know from the things I have done in the past that everything has to link together. And there, if you look at each individual thing on the farm, um, the nectar, for example, this has to be um, the collection of the nectar, the growth of it, and uh, the, uh, and when it dies and all that, those are all like one part of the program. Everything on here is a part that it has to connect. It has to come together. And if the, something is miscoded in there, of course it's going to have an issue. That's something I would love to learn is coding. I love the normal mystery without the bunny, so give me a heart attack. Isn't there a song with that has about a heart attack in it? Heart, 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 heart attack. Yeah, don't mind me, folks. <laughs> Is this been helped? No. All right, I've got the revive there. Somebody wants to do it, I think. I'm waiting to, hoping we'll get um, a help task, but it's not coming. We did, we've already done two trucks and two mining tasks. Um, just to show you guys, you talk about the Blossom Derby. I can show you where we have the rule. Uh, blossom task, wheat, corn, carrots, soybeans, mushrooms, I can delete this one to get it out of the way. Mushrooms truck orders, mining help the train. Have 23 visitors ready in town before you even take that train task. If you have those visitors ready, it makes the uh, your derby go much faster, that you can finish faster. And we try to finish fast. Um, Fast and Furious <laughs> is what Rockstar likes to call it, and um, it, it, it pays off, everybody. We, uh, Jessica, no more truck tests than how to train, though. <laughs> uh, I'll help feed you for the truck task, Jessica, if we get another one. But our, here's what our uh, trophies look like. 164 gold, 48. Uh, silver and 14 bronze and the derby was established in 2017 uh, this neighborhood was so it's gonna have a birthday before heyday does <laughs> and I usually on the day our anniversary I usually run a couple of little contests or something so I'll probably do the same uh, I hide revives over the farm for them to go find and I don't tell them they're there they find it and they tell me, hey, they, they found one or something. Am I correct it and they canceled the Bunny Mr. Derby from the game? Uh, I 
they may have in the past, but we have told them that unless they uh, alter some of the tasks, we don't need a bunny mystery. I can go back and look to see if they have, because the bunnies has only been around a couple of years. So I'll go back and look on that and see. Has anybody got any questions about the update or somebody still having special problems that they didn't see here in the chat? Because I have a list to uh, post to the team later tonight. It'd be silly to post it too early because they're home sleeping right now. Yeah, there's a five or six hour difference between them and me. Hello, Roz. How are you doing? Only your farm pass. Okay, Sherry, what happened on your farm pass? Sherry didn't have any problems. I can honestly say that the only problem I'm having is with the banana trees because I didn't come on before maintenance. Yeah, Sherry, it seems most people are having problems that was online before maintenance started. Well, that's what triggered the maintenance, the problems they were having. I believe I saw the first report of problems went in at uh, about 1.29 my time this morning. So I'm on central time so you guys can figure out what time it went down for me. It came on after maintenance. Well, what kind of problems are you having with your farm pass? You got 600 wheel, <laughs> windmills, MJ? Oh yes, that's happening. I have that written down, MGA, to report that uh, people are being booted on edit mode. We had this issue before. Make sure I have all these notes. You lost all your awards even though you finished your farm pass. I did not that's the first time I've heard of anybody losing all their rewards. So you didn't have your uh, chicken vouchers or chick vouchers, Sherry? Uh, Darlene, you stopped doing train tasks because a couple of times you accept a task to serve certain people, then the game didn't send any of those people for me to serve. Well, the game is not going to send them to you. Uh, when I have a certain type of task, uh, let's say the old man, the wizard, <laughs> uh, I go around and try to collect as many as I can from my neighbors, and then I will force a train in. I'll spend the diamonds and force the train in so that I can get all the things that I need. All the visitors. So, MJ, is it just on your Cowbell Lane farm? You complete the farm pass, okay, Sherry? Now my boat help and Wheel of Fortune is extra spend is gone. Oh yes, that, that happened to a lot of people. Hopefully, Sherry, they will get those fixed. Oh, yeah, people have reported those too, Sherry. This stuff has all been reported too. I'm going to make sure that I'm making notes to go along too because I want to make sure that they still have these all posted. If not, I'm going to add to them. Darlene says she tries to collect people from her one and the only neighbor too. Uh, that's the a benefit of having a, a support farms. Just a second, my computer's going into a virus check.
Uh, that's one of the benefits of having other farms. Um, I can go in here to my second farm, which I have in the neighborhood with me, and I will go over. This is how I help the neighborhood out with visitors. And like I said, an extra farm would help. Um, I'm going to have to wait for the train to come in and do its thing. Hello, Malik. Good morning to you. You're kind of up early, up early, aren't you? I think the diamonds could have been a little bit more than 20 for the time they were done. They, they should have been much better. I think the diamonds should have been five for every hour we were down. Down when weren't we down about six and a half to seven hours? Long time. <laughs> I'm looking in the chat here. Sherry, uh, Sherry, message me and give me your farm tag number later, and I can have them go in and take a look and see what happened. Their tech. Missions are very slow. <laughs> no comment. <laughs> Hi, Lisa. Okay, anybody else have anything they want to add? Lisa, it's, we're probably getting ready to close up here because I don't stream a long time. <laughs> Peter is sleepy. Peter's probably off in the corner somewhere. <laughs> Everyone should have gotten their choice of valley prize, more diamonds, and the mm -hmm. farm pass to be equal. Mm -hmm. It's really odd how this happened, though, because mm -hmm. before the maintenance, mm -hmm. so many people lost so much, and they didn't gain it back after the maintenance. Uh -oh. Yeah, Sherry, I showed that earlier in the stream. Uh, let me release these people here and see if I have, mm -hmm. I got one there. Mm -hmm. Okay, I will go and let all of my visitors go because it helps the neighborhood out for their task. Now that I've let these people all go for a task, <laughs> I need to go back to my farm and get, in case, uh, let's see, Jessica, in case we get a, a farm or a train task, I better get ready for one. That's what I'll always preach to everybody else is to be ready. And look at that. Look at those people all standing around. Shame on you, Phoebe. Shame, shame. Do I have anybody ready? Yep, I got five, four. Okay, I'm going to get the fast people. Hey. Uh -huh. The beach house is fast. I'm going to skip the um, B and B for right now. Uh -huh. And uh -huh. diner is not too fast, but it's not too slow either. Oi. This is the fastest uh -huh. building as the grocery. And we'll do this. Uh -huh. We'll do the grocery because uh -huh. then we can put it in the diner next. I, I, you guys, this is not etched in concrete or anything, but I do anticipate that maybe we will have another mm -hmm. maintenance because there's so many issues right now. I do anticipate that. Uh, oh, I don't have anybody that could be really fast. Ooh, let's see, I can get 
10 visitors. Let's go see what my neighbors have to offer, if anything. Oh, the one I just released over here. See how my second farm helps me out? Get the fast task here. Diner is faster than the cinema. Okay, I got my 10 visitors. Now let's go back over and see if we can... Let's see, I need to get 19 visitors set up in case we get another uh, train task. Malik has a good hood. Okay, let's start lining some of these people up hey. so we can get uh -huh. a bed. Grocery store is already full. I don't have the olives. I have to go collect some olives. And we'll take care of the other people first. These are all people, do you know it? Not visitors. <laughs> Whoops. Grocery store is full. How many will this give me? Uh oh, it's only going to give me bummers. I can't count them. There's five at Catalina. Come back here. It's only nine. I needed 19. Okay, I'm going to have to go hunt some more visitors up here in a few minutes when I get some of these sent away. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and end it, everybody. See, that isn't fair. Uh, Lisa, it was a bad glitch at their end, and they're probably correcting it. I don't know yet for sure, but... So, I'm going to go ahead and sign off, everybody. Uh, if you have any more issues... Please uh, let us know over on my Discord, and the link is underneath the uh, video if you don't get it in the stream here, and report any of your problems so I can uh, put them in my report for uh, the team later, okay? So thank everybody for coming. Thanks to our fantastic mod, C Farms, oh, Russell, oh. and he says, he says I'm cute. Thank you guys very much, and thank everyone for coming tonight. Bye now. Mm -hmm. See you on Sunday.